Hi, Water Signs. My name is Debbie, and I'm an intuitive reader. And I'm here today to give you guys your bonus readings for all the water signs out there. Hopefully, you guys are doing well, guys. Don't forget to smash that like button, share, comment down below, as well as subscribe if you haven't already. So let's get into it here. Uh, you can check out the link, the Amazon link down below in the description box. We're going to start off first for the sign of Scorpio. My book is out on Amazon, so check it on out. So things came to an end, I feel, Scorpio. You're trying to balance your life here, but it's tough to get this person off of your mind. You got the Ten of Wands, the Queen of Pentacles. I know you guys are water signs here and cups, you know. But you got the Four of Pentacles. So it's kind of like you're trying to balance out your life again. Could be focused on money with all those Pentacles too. But it's 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 two messages what I'm feeling. A, I feel that it's hard to get this person off of your mind. They're kind of planted in there, you know. But I also feel that you're trying to wish for yourself for the best. You're trying to manifest progression here. You're really focusing on healing your energy, but I really feel that you're trying to move away from an old situation and kind of balance your life. I feel like there's a little bit of lost hope, okay? But it's going to take time, okay? So now they're giving me advice, all right? So now I feel that you should keep going with balancing out your life. You can always manifest this person back into your life again. But I really feel that you need to kind of move away and work on other things. You know what I mean? Uh, it's tough to do. It's definitely tough to do because you're, you're like thinking a lot to the point where you're manifesting. I do feel you keep manifesting. You heal your energy here. You got two nights looking at each other, heading right towards each other. Plus you have the Sagittarius energy you could be dealing with. Uh, but really it's about just a matter of time. So basically the, what this tells me, I just heard twin flame. So you could be dealing with the twin flame here, but regardless, I feel that it's time to either work on money, job, finances here, uh, make yourself productive with something as a distraction kind of thing, and just overall balancing your energy here. Once you come, once you settle your energy, you will properly manifest this person back in, even though I still feel that you are. But there is going to be a reuniting here, but there's, there's steps along the way to fix for yourself first, is my point. And then that person will be returning, is what this tells me. Okay. It was an interesting way of putting it. Cancer. Somebody from your past still loves you, Cancer. That's for sure. It could be with the fire sign energy here. Wow. Okay. So I feel, Cancer, that you're trying to manifest your past to come back. I do feel they are going to be coming back. However, I feel that it's there's like there's an emotional roller coaster. One minute you're kind of calm, trying to get them to show the action back to you, okay, with that uh, King of Wands looking at that Six of Cups, and it's confirmed by the Sun. The Sun is known as the Yes card. And then there are times where you just get so frustrated where you don't even want to think about them. You don't want to think about, I just heard, Twin Flame Journey here. I do feel all in all that there's definitely divine energy. Spirit wants you to know that it's all in God's hands. I literally heard that. You're on a spiritual journey here and to kind of refocus. Like when you are thinking about them and manifesting for their return here, try to delete this, this frustration, okay? Now, we're all human. Spirit knows this, okay? This is all divine timing. But Spirit sees all here and I do feel that you know, uh, they are going to be returning back to you, but it's just a matter of time, but there's still a little bit more work. So basically canceling out that frustration is definitely going to help with this proceeding of this twin flame journey is what the message is. Leave it in God's hands. I just heard that again. So definitely that is your message for you, Cancer. Okay. Moving on to the sign of Pisces. Spirit, please show me what does the sign of Pisces need to know. After a very uh, confusing situation here, 
they had to make a choice, an option. This is somebody that you're dealing with. Could be with another water sign as well. I am picking that very strongly. You also have Leo. You have a justice card, which is Libra here. But I do feel that somebody wants to give back into this again. They want to make things right. Justice is all about fixing it. Now, I do feel it's going to take them a lot because they know that they seriously messed up a situation. You know what it feels like? It's kind of like they love you so much that they got too much in their head. They got overwhelmed by emotions, by confusion. It's kind of, it's a twin flame, definitely. A lot of twin flame energy for water signs right now. But definitely, they're making that option in regards to love to fix things here, to give back into this relationship again. I am feeling, though, that it was a very confusing situation of how to go about it. How do I fix it? Somebody's getting flowers. I just heard that. Yeah, they just showed me roses. Uh, but definitely, I read roses. So definitely, there could be some kind of roses, some kind of gift of a return here. I do feel that they will be successful with the, having the strength to fix it, strategizing, coming up with a plan. Twin flame. Uh, that is underneath the emperor. A lot of fire here. Now, that's Aries as well. But I'm really feeling that's the twin flame trying to have that inner strength again to communicate, to make things right with you. Because they definitely want to give back into this relationship again. And that's what I have for not just Pisces, but for all the water signs. Thanks, guys, for watching, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.